Now, we are going to be doing a meetup later this week, and it's going to be on Thursday. We're doing a hike. At Sugarlands Visitor Center in the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. Sugarlands Visitor Center. Troll's going to be there. Troll 2009 is going to be there. I made it to the Sugarland Visitor Center about 30 minutes. Okay, 40 minutes late. And uh, the group had already left. So I took the trail out to the John Holmby cabin to see if maybe I could catch up with them. Somehow I missed them again. They, they are not at the cabin. <laughs> this is what happens, guys, when you're like me. You like to sleep in. Uh, time gets away from you. Oh, that's a low hanging door right there. Almost hit my forehead. It's a painful thing to hit your forehead without a stormtrooper helmet on. Oh my goodness. It's kind of a nice cabin. Really, a lot of rough hewn logs and everything here. They're probably further along the trail somewhere. That's pretty. As much as I'd like to linger around this cabin, I really do want to catch up with the group. So, we're going to say goodbye to the John Holmby cabin. Along with all of its old world awesomeness. What kind of mortar is this? If it, is that... Alright, let's see if we can find them. Well, as it turns out, they were going to Cataract Falls first. Yep. So when I was at the cabin, they hadn't been to the cabin yet. So I went all the way back to the visitor center. And we're almost done. Finally got the message that they were at Cataract Falls. Started heading back towards Cataract Falls. Met up with Kay on the trail. She said they're at the cabin. Went to the cabin. They were not at the cabin. They were heading back to the visitor center. Now we are about few hundred yards from the visitor center. <laughs> and I'm so you hiked it by yourself? Uh, twice. Twice. <laughs> <laughs> but we're here. We got the whole group, everybody. Uh, we got William. William. <laughs> don't fall down the trail. Blondie from these Adventures. Don't know, don't know yet. Yet. We got some people to get to know. Danielle, of course. And Traveling Hoosier. Uh, I did... I met up with them at Three Rivers Festival in Indiana, and now we're meeting up again, two states away. Two states away. <laughs> in Tennessee, and the Smoky Mountains National Park. And what is your, your camel bag filled with there? Is that Gatorade? Gatorade. Yep. You got, a, got a, a, a camel water pouch. Oh, it's a shark. A shark. Oh, shark actually. And, oh uh, wait, no, this is the camel pack here. So that still that actually feels like it's still got plenty of fluid there. It does. You don't want to drink it all at once. No. Well, I mean, we're almost back to the parking lot now, so. <laughs> I see. Uh, so this is TML57, and uh, you have a YouTube channel of your own. Um, how long have you been doing your YouTube channel? Since I was 57, and I'm 69. Uh, what kind of stuff is on your um, YouTube channel? I used to race RC cars. And most of my videos were me winning. <laughs> and, and then winning. I started hiking in uh, April of 2011. Okay. First visit up here. And now I include uh, whatever I see. Maybe uh, Cumberland Gap, maybe Panther Creek State Park, maybe right. the Smokies, maybe Illinois where my folks live. So you've got um, how, about how many subscribers are you up to now? I got about 15. Most of my family. Well, now that we've done this little interview, it'll probably be a few more. <laughs> well, uh, Will, Yankee in the, in the South. Yeah. He started out three years ago with just family. Right. And then he filmed downtown Gatlinburg right, yeah. the day of the fire. And look what he's got now. Yeah. About 15,000. I'm, I'm, I'm not looking at having that kind of a. Yeah. C O O A U. Wow. Yeah. It's like okay. $60 off of Amazon. It's got image stabilization. And I never go above uh, 1080p because it doesn't work at 4K. Okay. And I might have to get me one of those because I need to upgrade. I, I've got a little sports camera that's. that's it's starting to get to where the uh, battery dies pretty fast. On it. And you you bolt it and lean it back. Right. And the reason I got this one 
is the external mic. Right, right, because mine doesn't pick up any sound at all when the case is on it. And <laughs> wind noise is gone. Oh, and my voice eliminates right the wind noise. Here. That's great. Oh my God. Whenever you're alone in the woods, so we're, we're you'll going find a bear. <laughs> That's when it happens, right? They're like, I should have brought my bear mace. The one time I forget my bear mace, I bear see a bear. bear. Now, normally you guys encounter black bears, and they're not nearly as aggressive, right? Yeah, you'll have the, <laughs> the, the bear jams through the... Yeah. yeah. I've the never bear had an issue with a bear ever. <laughs> never had an issue with a bear? No, I had one bear, like, try to... Sniff me out to see what I'm about. He wanted to know if you had some food on you. He's like, I know you got but a Snickers sitting he, in there somewhere. As soon as he got a good whip of it, he took off the other way. He didn't want nothing to do with that. <laughs> Anytime no, I hear stories like that, I always no, think I of that. that I always think no, of that uh, <laughs> that movie, The Great Outdoors, with John Candy. Yes. Yeah, when he like they went to the dump to watch the bears, and they didn't they didn't think they had a close enough look, so they put Snicker bars on the hood of the car. We got we got the rest of the group. Oh, you can barely see them. They're way up there. See, we're the uh, we're the, the the fun side of the island. Fun we're, we're the fun side of the island here. <laughs> okay. Could have done the Ash entire Jones. trip with you guys. Hey. So yeah, we had everybody here today. Troll. Y'all know the troll. Troll 2009, 2009, ladies and gentlemen. 2009. The best Facebook group admin I'm ever. On YouTube channel too, right? Uh, Will's talking about his artistic process whenever he does the slow motion and the time lapses. Yes. And he links them together, time with music and all that yeah. fancy stuff. I do it stuff. different ways. Of course, I, like the, I yeah. like the natural way, which is, especially with the waterfall, um, just the, the sound being there. I'll do that for, you know, so long. Yeah. But then after that, I'll put a little music and just kind of get into a, a rhythm with the waterfall and fast, slow, just kind of give, like, different senses about that. Yeah. Waterfall. And the thing is, too, like you, you did one time, you did um, something with a fair or a big Ferris wheel, yep. and you actually recorded the Ferris wheel in the reflection of a pool yes. or a puddle in, yep. in, the, in the parking lot. Uh, when you film, you always look around. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Different. What it is, you want to bring your audience into your video. So you want to, you want to if, if it's rainy or if it's muggy, you want to show either like um, some rain dew or rain yeah. or a mud Hit, or a hitting water the tree puddle limbs. or like I like when there's a if there's a puddle and if it's raining, I like to shoot the puddle with the rain dropping into it. Things right. like that, and then have that in with slow the motion a little bit with the reflection of where you're at. Right. See, this is an artistic thing that I have yes. not been able to get a handle like, on. Like, try to. Well, we want our audience to feel that we're there with us, you know. Yeah. And that's what we that's what we try to shoot for every single time. Uh, and by the way. Uh, we're here at the... We are back to the visitor center. And uh, they've actually got like a taxidermy display in there with a bunch of birds. Uh, there's yeah. a little theater. Um, there's, uh, I don't, what is the theater show? Some kind of oh, history just, of the Smoky Mountains? It's about Mountains? the Smokies. Okay. Getting you all riled up for the Smokies. Right, yeah. 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 But once you get out here to this visitor center, don't expect to be able to message anyone. There is no coverage out here. Most of the at all. No yeah. No Do all your coordinating before you get here. <laughs> Oh my word, let's see if it'll do it again. That was crazy. I told you they were evil. He's got he's got this bird right here next to him and it actually flew up, pecked him between the eyes and flew, and landed back down on the ground. Blondie from Blondie's Adventures needed a drawing of herself, um, an individual. Individual drawing. The one I did at the Three Rivers Festival was her and Traveling Hoosier together. She wanted one by herself for her channel. Just got my easel out and did this one. So, Thanks. mission successful. I believe it's a pretty good likeness there. I think it's awesome. Yeah. And that that whole bird attacking Will, that happened while this drawing was going on. So, <laughs> <laughs> wow. And what's weird, I've never seen that happen before, but Danielle has actually got like an irrational fear of birds. And the only time in my life I've seen a bird peck somebody in the face is while she's sitting right there. Did, did, did you did you bring that up? Did you bring that about? Yeah, did that happen? Yeah, crazy <laughs> uh, I wish I'd gotten a video of it. I think I think uh, you're gonna have uh, that little, little, little video. Footage, yeah, yeah on his on his video. So look that up. Oh, he, he attacked him! Oh, he's, oh, he's back. there. He's back. Okay. Maybe he'll do it again. Everybody stay close. 
He's right above Danielle. Uh oh. Dan. Dan. He's right. Look, he's looking at Danielle. He's looking at Danielle. Look at this. Uh oh. Danielle, come over this way. Come this way. Okay, so that bird. Get away from it. That bird is back. He's right up in the tree. This is like this is an irrational fear that is actually makes sense right now. At this at this exact moment, this actually makes sense. So he's out stalking individuals now. Look at that. He doesn't mind how close we're getting. He's gonna peck me. Yeah, but he's gonna peck you. Oh, his his mouth is open. He's looking for blood. He he's tasted blood. Now he wants more. I'm getting even closer. I got the camera at arm's length. Actually, he's getting mad, dude. He's getting mad. Come on, do something. Do something. Do something. You ornery little thing. Come at me, bro. He doesn't get ya. Come at me, bro. <laughs> <Come> at me. <laughs> he's already came at William and he took a piece of him. He wants more. Will's doing his outro. Is everybody in this? Yes. Is everybody in? <laughs> well, even though I got there late, they were all good sports about it. We were able to spend a lot of time together, had some fun. We got to see William from Smoky Mountain Hiker get pecked by a bird. Now, it looked it looked very mundane, but actually, he's got a pink yeah, spot. It was pretty serious. Yeah, he's actually blinking right now because it flapped its wings and hit him in the eye a little bit. It pecked him. You can see a little bird. It's, right it's actually not a joke. <laughs> we were like, hey, let's see if he'll do it again. But no, actually, yeah, it's not. we don't actually want it to do it again. <laughs> Anyway, it's been great, guys. We got uh, Blondie from Blondie's Adventure, uh, Traveling Hoosier, Will and Don from Yankee in the South, where 90% of my subscribers come from. <laughs> of course, <laughs> Troll2009, the best Facebook admin ever. Well, it's right up there with Karen's story. We're going to get to meet you at some point, Karen's story. <laughs> and she has a storytelling YouTube channel of her own. So links to everybody's uh, channels in the description. It's been fun guys, but we got to say that's a wrap on this one. If you liked it, hit the thumbs up like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. Make sure to turn on notifications. Leave some comments. And look forward to seeing you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Thanks for Bye. watching. Bye-bye <laughs> everyone. Happy trails everybody. Happy trails. <laughs>